Hey there, Megan with Primary Singing. Today I'm going to show you the hand actions for Samuel Tells of the Baby Jesus. I can't believe another year has flown by that it's already Christmas time, but I love this time of year. I love bringing out the Christmas songs. Um, if you're like me, you'll probably start doing Christmas songs in the fall time, so it kind of extends this special time. So. I want to share this simple hand action pattern for you that's really just meant to provide some body engagement for learning this activity. A lot of times I find with kids that when our body's engaged, our minds are engaged. So if we're doing actions, if our body's moving, um, then that can help us to retain the information, especially for our kinesthetic learners. Um, so for this song, I have a two-page pattern that you can find. I'll link it below in the description box with some hand actions for keywords in the song. And then in the chorus, when we have our Hosanna, Hosanna, we're going to do something a little bit different. So let me just kind of go through the verse and then I'll go through the whole song together. So we have for said Anytime in a primary song that we have said or say or tell, I like to use this megaphone. So we said, said Samuel within five years. You're gonna make a big number five with your fingers. And then it says the night will be as day. So for this one, we're gonna do some twinkly stars. The night will be as day. So then for day, we're gonna kind of draw an outline of the sun. And then we have in baby Jesus, will be born. So you can kind of cradle and rock the baby. And baby Jesus will be born in a land far, far away. So there's a couple ways you could do this one. Um, one fun way is just to kind of sweep your hand so it's like far, far away, or you could point in a different direction. Um, whatever you remember best to help your kids. And then when we have Hosanna, we have a clap and pat pattern. So we're gonna have Hosanna. So the first one is gonna be Hosanna. And then the second one will be a clap and three pats. Hosanna. You'll get that better when I sing it. Okay, and then we have Let Us Gladly Sing. So for this one, you can just wave your arms like you're pretending to conduct. You can actually conduct or you can just have the kids wave their arms. Let us gladly sing how blessed that our Lord was born. So for how blessed, we're going to kind of put our hand on our heart because we are so thankful that Jesus was born. So how blessed that our Lord was born. We're going to do another kind of cradle. Let earth receive her king. So for that one, you'll kind of pretend like you're putting a crown on your head. So I'm going to go through the whole song and sing through it. That way you kind of have a better idea for how it goes. Um, be sure to check out the description box for the printable um, activity details, some different extension ideas, and then also you can find um, some other ways that we're using this activity in singing time and other review ideas. So. Said Samuel, within five years, the night will be as day, and baby Jesus will be born in a land far, far away. Hosanna, Hosanna, oh let us gladly see. It's as simple as that. Really, it's just some keywords in the song. If you think of some other actions to add, let me know what you add. You can always um, add to or simplify these actions if you want to just have a few, or if you want to add more, you can also do that. So, thanks so much for being here with me. I hope to see you next time.